encrypt this, download the file here, wrap your answer with Pico CTF, put underscores in place of pauses, and use all lowercase. Audacity is a really good program to analyze Morse code audio. So we can download the file, and then we can open that in Audacity. So the long things are dashes and the short things are dots. So we're going to need a Morse code translator. Okay, so we'll look here at this file. So we see like dot dash dash. Dot dot dot. Four dots, then four dots and a dash. Four dots, four dots and a dash. Two dashes, three dots. Three dots, four dots, four dots and a dash. Dash dash dot dot dot. Dash dash dot dot dot. Four dots and four dashes and a dot. Four dots. Dash is in a dot. Five dashes. One dash and two dots. Okay. Then dot dash dash. Dot dot dash dash dash. Dot dash dash. Dot dash dash dash. Five dashes, five dashes, two dots and a dash. Four dashes and a dot, followed by four dots. Two dashes followed by three dots. So we got this fun string here. Let's just put that all in lowercase. Okay, then I talked about gap. So it looks like we have a gap here. That looks bigger, I think, than the other gaps. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 characters from the end. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 characters from the end. And then we had one, two, three, four characters in a gap. One, two, three, four characters in a gap, I think. So four, four, three characters in a gap. So four characters in a gap, four characters in a gap, three characters in a gap. So I think that's what it looks like. Copy that. And there we go.